Hi everyone, welcome to Best Recipes with Sharon. How about this recipe for pineapple upside down cakes? This is old fashioned style and completely homemade. So that tells you something about the flavor right there. So let me show you how it's made. Start by melting a half a cup of butter in a saucepan. And simply add one cup of packed brown sugar. Remove it from the heat. Then mix it until the brown sugar and butter are well combined and set it aside until you're ready to use. It will thicken up a little bit and be easier to spoon into your pans. Then take a large muffin tin and grease about eight of them. And open a can of pineapple slices. And set aside about eight maraschino cherries. Onto the delicious old fashioned cake batter. Then take four large eggs and separate the egg yolks from the egg whites and place them both in separate bowls. Now using a hand mixer, beat the four egg yolks until they're frothy, then set them aside. And then beat the egg whites until they form soft peaks. Now gradually add one cup of white sugar. I did this by half a cup at a time and beating well in between. And once the full cup of white sugar has been added, continue beating until it forms medium stiff peaks. Then remove your attachment from your mixer and in a separate bowl mix together your dry ingredients. So add one cup of sifted cake flour, then a quarter teaspoon of salt, and one teaspoon of baking powder. Then whisk this together with a fork and set aside. Now back to the beaten egg whites. We're going to mix the egg whites and the egg yolks together now. So using a whisk or a large spoon, just fold it over on top of itself until the batter is well mixed. Then take your dry ingredients and slowly add them and mixing each time you add a little bit more. Just mix it enough to have it well combined. Don't over mix. And it should look something like this. And now that the batter is a bit thick, I'm going to switch to a large spoon. Then I'm adding one teaspoon of almonds extract. Now finally one teaspoon of butter that has been melted. Then just fold that in with your large spoon. Back to preparing the bottom of the muffin tins. Start by putting one tablespoon of the brown sugar and butter mixture in the bottom of each muffin tin. This recipe will make enough for about eight of them. So then take your pineapple slices and place them on top of the butter and brown sugar. Next, add your maraschino cherries in the middle of each. Then evenly distribute your cake batter onto the top of each of these. Now place your mini cakes in a 325 degree oven for approximately 30 minutes. They will look slightly golden but a toothpick inserted in the middle will come out clean or when you lightly touch it it will spring back easily. Now let it rest in the pan for about 5 minutes. Then lightly loosen the edges with a knife like this. And then take it and quickly turn it over onto a cookie sheet. And gently lift the pan off like this. If you find that any of the cherries have been displaced, then just take a knife or a spoon and relocate the cherry. That's as simple as it is. You have your very own mini upside down cakes. They're great little personal cakes for individual portioning. Also great for freezing and taking them out as you need them. You can serve this as a dessert, hot or cold. This cake is light and flavorful and well worth making. So I hope everyone's staying safe out there and thanks for watching Best Recipes with Sharon. Until next time, happy eating.